a lot of people were asking IG live or on my live streams, what are those things on top of your records that you don't need needles to play on the records? So these are what these are, Phase DJ, go grab them, I recommend them. <laughs> Hey guys, it's boy DJ Tilt and I'm back with another video. Today I'm talking about these guys. They are the Phase DJs. So these bad boys, they go on top of your records and you basically don't need needles to play. Say what again? You don't need needles to play. Go on. So they first showcased these at the NAMM show, uh, which is the biggest trade uh, event in Anaheim, California. They have it every year in January. Uh, and 2018 is when they first showcased this bad boy. Jazzy Jeff was shown using an A-Track, all the heavy hitter DJs, and it was revolutionary because you basically don't have to use needles anymore. Due to delays and technicalities, they actually came, released this on March, the next year later, March 2019. So I picked these up in July, um, just cause they were so dope. I wanted to try them. I got the two pack which is costs about $5.49 here in Canada. And if you want the ultimate essential four pack, uh, that goes for $8.49. They cost a lot, so I only stuck with the two. But mind you, that time of July last year, the battery life, they said maybe five hours, um, but I only got, I'd say four and a half. I tried it once at the club. Uh, it lasted about, uh, once, once four hours hit, you saw the battery dwindling on it. So since then, I only use them at home. So it was great to use for recording home live mixes, uh, just cause when I use regular needles, you don't have to ever worry about needle skipping, uh, dust on your needles. So for recording purposes, they were amazing. Um, but I actually haven't bought another needle since. Um, just cause one, I basically use CDJs, Pioneer CDJs. They're at every single club. They're, uh, they're on my rider for when I do corporate events, when I travel, because all I really need is two USB sticks. But myself and a lot of other DJs that I grew up playing on turntables, there's no, nothing better feel than, than vinyl on your fingertips, right? So when these came out, I had to grab them. Like I said, the shelf life was only four hours, so I, I only used them when I recorded stuff at home. I never brought them to the club. It wasn't until December there was a new update Game changing update. It lasts seven hours. So that my, one of my biggest problem was, can it last the whole night at the club? And a lot of DJs out there, they'll play maybe five hour sets, four to five hour sets, if you're doing the whole night. Um, so you wanted something that could last that long. Uh, if you, or if you're doing a corporate event or a wedding event, it could last six, seven hours, depending on what you're paid to do. So having good, reliable stuff would always work. And before then, I would always carry needles in my in my bag just in case these didn't work out fast moving forward uh the homie dj ills told me about the new update and they last seven hours he he left them on when he went to sleep woke up in the morning they were still on um it was crazy so once i downloaded it, i tested it the saturday just before new year's eve and it worked fine at the club so i wanted to do it again obviously for new year's eve I was playing with the homie JB Allen at the club down here in Toronto, uh, regulars bar, and everything worked like a charm, start to finish. And even when I finished, I still had five bars remaining on my phase DJ. I've been meaning to do this video probably, I don't know, since I got these, but DJ Tilt here, and today we are unboxing the phase DJ. Ta da! So another thing I wanted to mention is that, yes, I got these in July and I played them, I used them at the clubs a couple of times, but every single time I would say there was a problem. It wouldn't connect uh, or one would connect, the, left, the right wouldn't connect. Okay, so I'm trying to use the face and you can see right here, it's not reading. I tried swapping with other DJs, I'd get like a, a weird robot echoey sound after it connected. Um, so basically every single time I tried it, it didn't work. Only use it at home for live mixes. And then it wasn't till December that I finally used them out 
and I'll co-sign on using him for good now. So what you get in the box is this. Two guys for your records left and right, a pair of RCA's uh, USB cord, and you don't get this, but basically I just found one of these. I have all these lying around at home. And that's what I use to just plug into an outlet. Don't plug it in to your actual computer. You can work, but save that USB and just have it dedicated. So if you want to switch with another DJ, you can do that. So ever since New Year's Eve, I've been playing them every week, obviously until the COVID-19 started to happen um, at the clubs. I just told the manager, set up the turntables every week. Now when I play rather than the CDJs, it feels better, it looks better. Um, and like I said, you never have to worry about getting the dust off the needles, the needle skipping. You don't even need to have good RCAs because they're not even connected. And one thing I learned uh, from my boy, uh, DJ Miguel Rockwell, when I was playing in Seattle, he had him set up and I was like, how are you gonna switch when I went on? And he's like, you don't need to because it's plugged in into, into, the, into the wall. So you plug these straight into an outlet. I, before, used to just plug it straight into my laptop. I didn't know. I thought they just had to be powered to the laptop. Obviously, they're working on an update that's gonna make it like HID mode. Um, but like I said, they're already stupid crazy. But you just have to plug these into an outlet and you can, any DJ can hop on and just use the phase without having to swap anything. So that's a great bonus. But the fact that now with these two just this these two guys alone you can get up to seven hours play um i don't even see a need to buy the ultimate essential pack like unless you're playing eight hours or more um then i would get the essential pack but right now these guys only take an hour to charge full battery okay so all you got to do is plug this end usb into this end other end plug into the outlet and then get your two rcas left and right obviously and then you're gonna plug him in to left and right channel of your mixer. Simple as that. Plug in the RCs straight into your line mixer, or not the phono, because you don't need the turntables anymore. Doesn't matter if, if these are faded, because um, you're not putting a needle on anymore. I'm gonna grab these guys. These are the, the magnetic stickers. You get four of them. Once these are down, obviously you just set them up, stick them right on your record, and they're gonna glow for a second. And once it stops, it's good to go. I did red for right and blue for left. And just like that, once you connect it, uh, you're good to go. And as you can see, So grab these, I recommend them because you get to play on tables all the time for your DJ sets. If you're like me and you like playing on 12s, go grab them. Till next time.